Wilbur Sir Gunaraj Me leva pra aquele lugar Deixarei a tristeza pra trás Quando eu danço toco o sorrir não tem fim Aqui o sol vai sempre brilhar Vamos lá, vamos lá, vamos lá, Wilbur Sir Gunaraj Greetings everybody, this is Wilbur Sir Gunaraj Boa tarde, how do you say? Boa tarde. Boa tarde! Greetings from Brazil. I am standing on the ground where they make the very first class Embraer jets. This, ladies and gentlemen, is Mr. Nicholas. Nice to meet you, sir. Nice to meet you. Welcome to Embraer. Thank you so much. Tudo bem? Tudo bem. Você. Como você me Como você. And with you. Very good. Thank you. Roman and we, what's it called? The city? The city is São José dos Campos. Yes. So today we are going to take a journey, we're going to show you a little bit about the facility, how the planes are made, where they are made, yes. in exactly. different locations and uh, I'm so excited. How do you say excited in Portuguese? Estou muito animado. Estou muito, muito animado. Behind us are, are the fuselage of the E-Jets. Okay, this is the fuselage of the E-Jets, the very popular E-Jets, yeah? Exactly. Embraer has another plant around the world, but to produce E-Jets, the yeah. commercial, it's just, just here. here. Okay. Just here, it's on the It's only here. Yeah, Embraer okay. produce executive jets in the US. In the US, okay. Okay, and there are other facilities also in Brazil, like Gavião Peixoto, where the company produced the KC-390. Okay, that's the military. The military, the, military, yeah. the airlifter. And also the Super Tucanos are produced there too. Okay. And also Embraer has another facility in a place called Botucatu. Botucatu. Where the company produces uh, large panels and structures. So this is the birthplace of the E series, right? Yes. Very, very premier class. Behind us is the fuselage. This is the assembled fuselage of the E's aircraft. Okay. So in this line, Embraer is able to produce the E1 and the E2. Okay, so this is the starting of the E1 and you can, you can go between both of them you can make. But it starts yes. here and you can do the E1 or the E2. Yes, it's what we call it's the beginning of what we call the hybrid line. This is the hybrid line. So this is where they put the wings together and uh, this is just before the final assembly. Yes. E-175 underneath. Yes, E-175. So E-175, uh, big success, especially in the North American market. More than 100 aircraft uh, sale in the past five years. So it's a big, it's a big success. Big success for a Very, very first class. How do you say first class in Portuguese? Primeira class. Para mim, a primeira class. Primeira class. Primeira class. Very good. This behind us is the four prototype of the E190 E2. So, and the aircraft was recently certified by all three major authorities, ANAC in Brazil, FAA in the US, and EASA from Okay, Europe. let's do terminology about this. ANAC is the... Uh, Agência Nacional de Aviação Civil. Okay. Or national uh, terminology. Uh, agency of... Uh, national agency of civil aviation. Okay. FAA, which is the Federal terminology. Uh, Aviation Administration. Yes. And the EASA, which is the European Authority the aviation, I believe. Okay. I'm sorry. I that is not by heart. Google it. No, I'm just kidding. Don't Google. You should not always trust what Google says. So you must be very excited. We all are. We all are. Estamos muito animados. Ah, estamos muito animados. Muito animados. Ah? Animados. Animados. Ah, pois somebody está animado. That lyric. Exactly. Eu quero é samba. We are in the, 
the delivery hangar. This is the delivery hangar. This is the delivery hangar. In each of these rooms, the customer can come uh, check all the documentation and also pay the aircraft. So it's ready to go. Before that, they they can do also a technical uh, inspection. Okay. So and this is the final stage before the aircraft flies to you home, the new home, okay. or or to the customer. Right. Okay, so we are inside the E one seven five. As you can see, there is the cockpit behind us, uh, behind Terminology. me. Uh, there's the cockpit behind me, and uh, the yoke you were saying it's in the shape the the Embraer logo, logo of the Embraer logo. That's yes. very very first class, and it's the same logo, uh, the same shape in the new model as well. Yes, in the E2, the wow. same yoke. The same yoke. What is the configuration here in this? Uh, is 76 seats. Okay, 76 uh, seats. With, uh, with uh, 12 uh, business class and 64 in uh, with economy and economy plus. 12 in a business class. We business are, class where <gasps> we are right now. We are sitting in business class and yes. that's first class and it's great, but I always fly economy, so we have to sit. Come on, sir, we have to see this economy. Uh, so you have more room in economy plus. Uh, more room, room for your legs. Okay, and the then this is uh, the economy regular. This is a regular. This yes. is making the, I always tell people, they have to make their economy first class. And one of the, the things that makes uh, make uh, the E-Jets very popular is the two plus shoe configuration, uh, yes. which means or you will not never get the middle seat. Or right. is an aisle or a window. Do you know anyone says, oh, I prefer the middle seat? No, I don't think so. So trying to make your economy first class in the middle seat is a little bit difficult. Exactly. And we are in economy and we're making our economy surroundings very first class with simple superstar, Mr. Nicolas. Muito obrigado. A gente que agradece. That means we thank you. And I thank you so much. It's a pleasure. Thank you so much, and it has always been a pleasure to be flying with Embraer. Roman Andri, thank you very much for watching this very first class field trips here in the Embraer. Very first class. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Muito bom. Muito bom. Legal. Where there's nowhere to dance, music and laughing, hear the sun always shine. Wilbur is even better. I don't know. Wilbur Sargunaraj.